16 people were killed in Israeli airstrikes in the Gaza Strip's Rafah city, the news agency AFP reported early Monday, May 6, citing medics and first responders. The toll of martyrs in Rafah reached 16, emergency first responders told AFP, adding that seven people from one family and nine from another family were killed in the Israeli attacks the airstrikes came hours after Hamas claimed responsibility for a rocket attack near Rafah which Israel said killed three of its soldiers and injured 11 more. Hamas armed wing said it fired rockets at an Israeli army base by the Karim Shalom crossing into Gaza. The Israeli military confirmed the counterstrike, saying it struck the launcher from which the Hamas projectiles were fired as well as a nearby, military structure. The military said 10 projectiles were launched from Rafah in southern Gaza towards the area of Karim Shalom, which it said was now closed for aid trucks going into the coastal enclave. Other crossings remained open. The launches carried out by Hamas adjacent to the Rafah crossing, are a clear example of the terrorist organization's systematic exploitation of humanitarian facilities and spaces and their continued use of the Gazan civilian population as human shields, the military added Hamas delegation to be in Qatar for truce talks. Sunday's attacks came as hopes dimmed for ceasefire talks between the warring factions. A Hamas official said that the group's delegation for Gaza truce talks in Cairo was leaving for consultations in Qatar after public disagreement with Israel intensified over demands to end their seven-month war.